Good morning, good morning. It is Saturday of Easter weekend and the kids found the little buckets that we put together for them and that was fun. They liked the books and everything. So now George is making arrowroot. Oh. We're gonna have some arrowroot for breakfast. That one is really big. Size on my head. <laughs> it's the size of your head. Actually, I've never seen, let me see this. I don't know if I've ever seen arrowroot looking like that. It looks like it has tentacles. It's a root. <laughs> I know, but I think I usually see it when it's already sliced or something. I don't know. Uh, we'll peel it. <laughs> Okay. Looks like it has tentacles. We're just trying to get ourselves moving this morning. Um, the house is a little chaotic, but it's okay. The kids are cleaning up their bedrooms and we're just trying to get things moving. But um, it rained last night. It looked like it was going to rain more this morning, but now the clouds are kind of clearing. So I'm kind of glad that we'll have some sunshine so we can do our Easter egg hunt and enjoy some activities outside this morning. Oh yeah. George is gonna plant some coffee trees today because the ground is now wet. Looks like the rains have arrived. Yeah, about 45 trees. Are all the holes, they, the holes are dug. Yeah, they're done, prepared. It's just waiting for me to just go put the trees on the ground. So. 45 of them, so that's what I'll be doing. Come show us the books you guys got for Easter. These kids are some serious readers. We still need to go to the library, but at least that will give you something to read in the meantime, huh? What'd you get, sis? A roll doll book. Roll doll. What'd you get? This book. Awesome friendly adventure. This one looks fun. It has like a lot of <clears throat> pictures. Looks very interesting. Um, you guys, please go brush your teeth, go change your clothes, go clean your rooms. Uh, yeah, go clean your rooms up. So now George and I will hide all these eggs. I think there's 50 of them, so there's a lot. We'll hide them around the compound and then the kids will come out and try to find them all we'll have to make it a little harder this year because they're older now they're full of candy I think we should put some inside that house. yeah the clubhouse We should do all this area and then down to the grill spot. Ready to go through, hunting? Gonna walk through the ring of whoopings. Hunting for <laughs> eggs. Okay, we're gonna hoping. pass through the ring of whoopings. <laughs> Keep going! Yes! What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What? Ma'am, so all of the eggs this year are from the playground area over, even in the grill area. So we're, they're not this side this year. They're this side. Go, go, go. Go find them. And you're gonna have to really search. 
because they're not all out in the open. You guys missed some over here, a bunch. One's still out there somewhere. Yeah, I should find another one. Liam, your shoes. Do you want to tell us the story of your shoes? Yeah. <laughs> Liam has two sets of sandals, and there's one that's broken on each set, so they're mismatched. So we're getting them fixed, but for now, this is what he, he's got going on. Okay, so right now we're posing a cute little Easter picture because London, tell us what your idea was. My idea was to bring out all the bunnies, the calm bunnies, and take a picture with them. Yeah, London wanted to take an Easter picture with all the bunnies, and I think it's the cutest idea ever. Because why would we not do this when we have all the Easter bunnies? We're trying to have a photo shoot. Got the eggs. Oh my gosh. Such a good idea, sis. That's a lot of sugar. <laughs> Too much sugar. Too much sugar. No more like when you're bitter, you need a lot of sugar. So maybe you're bitter inside. <laughs> So now I am going to make our Easter ice cream treat. And I actually got this idea from Marilyn, my friend Marilyn, who lives in Narok. So Marilyn, if you happen to watch this, thank you so much for the idea and we're excited to try it. It sounds really good, so you will get our review in just a second because we've never tried it before. You guys wanna try a Ribena float? So I got this vanilla ice cream from Naiva's. It was buy one, get one free. So I don't think we've tried this brand of ice cream before. So we'll try it out. So it's been sitting out on the counter for a few minutes. So let's see if it's soft enough. Let me try the ice cream by itself. See what we're dealing with here. Not bad. Okay, so let me tilt this down. So it's just vanilla ice cream. Probably do a few scoops. We need to get an ice cream scoop. 
There's a lot of kitchen items that we still need to <laughs> add to our collection. I'm just using a spoon, probably fill it like halfway with vanilla ice cream. And then you take some Sprite, which has been in the fridge. So it's nice and cold. All right, then nice okay so we have the ice cream and the sprite and now i have the ribena concentrate i'm not sure if marilyn used the concentrate or if she mixed it with water and then just put it in as juice but i'm assuming since we have sprite i'll just put like a small drizzle of this like a very small drizzle so it's just kind of like a syrup on the top or not on the top but mixed in yeah like that Ooh, look at that <laughs> that actually looks really good yeah, I think the syrup is a good choice because then you just put a little drizzle and it gives it a nice probably add more Sprite let me get some of this foam off You're gonna like this is it's so that ribena with the sprite is actually a very good combination Ooh, now look at it Can I have the hmm. so this is what we are calling a ribena float uh, okay that, that's all right just get three spoons. Um, lucas liam do you guys want to try Can I take this one? Okay, London's gonna review it for us. Tell us how she likes it. Did you get any ice cream or just the foam? Mm. Mm. Did you get the ice cream? Mm, that's really good. Really good? This is a nice, like, refreshing, cold treat. A nice treat. Maybe for this one, I'll put the ice cream, and then I'll put a drizzle of, <gasps> of the Ribena. And then I'll add the Sprite. Almost overflowed. Lucas likes it, and I'm quite confident that Liam will like it too. But yeah, we've had a fun Saturday so far. And then tomorrow we'll head to Kanyakine. Um, George's auntie told us that it rained pretty good last night, and the roads leading to her house get pretty muddy so that should be an adventure but hopefully it doesn't rain too much like tonight and then we should be fine all right i'm gonna do a load of laundry george had to head out to a meeting. That's why he's not here right now. Um, but yeah, we've had a good day so far and excited for one more day of Easter celebrating. London, I see you. Um, but thank you guys for watching and we'll see you tomorrow.